Okay, we want to find the area of this hexagon and they're only giving us the side length of 20 inches. How do we find the area? Well, the first step you want to do is you want to divide this regular hexagon up into congruent triangles. So that's what we're going to do here first. And then what we're going to do is we're going to focus in on one of these triangles. If we can find the area of this triangle, we can multiply it by six since there's six of them to find the total area. But the first thing we want to do is we want to find out how much is this central angle right here? Well, we know in a circle that's 360 degrees, but since there's six triangles, let's divide this by six. So each of these central angles is going to be 60 degrees. Now, if we take a look at this triangle down here, this is a 60 degree angle. If we drop a perpendicular, okay, which is called the apothem here, that's going to split this angle in half. So now it's going to be 30 degrees and 30 degrees. It's also going to bisect the base. So each one of these is going to be 10 inches. But how do we find the height of this triangle, the apothem? Well, you can see we've got a 30, 60, 90 degree triangle. And just a quick refresher on our 30, 60, 90 degree triangles, the side across from the 30 degree angle we call X, that's the short leg. The side across from the 60 degree angle, that's our longer leg, that's X squared of three. And the one across from the right angle, that's our longest side, that's two X. So here you can see that this is gonna be across from the 30, that's our X side, 10. The longer leg, the one across from the 60 degree angle is gonna be 10 times the square root of three. So if we wanna find the area of this triangle, which is this bottom triangle right here, we just have to do area equals one half the base. Okay, so the base is 20 times the height, which is 10 squared of three. And then all we have to do is multiply by six since we have six of these triangles. So we're gonna multiply by six. So let's see, we've got a half of 20 is 10 times six is 60 times 10 root three is 600 squared to three inches squared since it's area. If you wanna see another example, check out the video I did right there. And if you want to uh, memorize some formulas here, you can use this one, one half apothem times perimeter or one half base times height times the number of triangles.